<laughs> Spring of the Eternal Hydros. Come on, can you not get up there? Oh, whoa. Okay, I didn't know you could climb. Well, I'm fucking stuck now. That Rian. Yeah, bye. Oh, God, stop it. I don't think I need that other key ring. Something definitely wrong with bags. Oh, what? Well, shit. No, I haven't I done a quick save. Yes. Fine. Greetings, Bentic. How are you? Quite well, you know, since I said last, I've done a little more reading into the meaning of various names. I'm more certain now that my name, itself and the ancient Ventec, I also found very well known for instance, where it was spelled Bentac. The interesting point is that I did some research on your name and found that in one case it actually comes from a very old pagan word for champion, or better translation, avatar. Well, that's useful, isn't it? I'm so glad you asked. This is a uh, treat on the world. How do you pronounce that? Whatever, on the world of pagan, it covers the idiosyncrasies of the various lands and people of our world. From the first chapter, it tells in depth depth about what motivates the people of the world and challenges the reader to make up his own mind about the condition of this world in which we live. Perhaps you would like to read it. Who is the author? Well, you see, well, uh, I am. Yes, thank you. I knew you were a well-read person who appreciates fine literature. Perhaps after you've read it, we'll get together and discuss our opinion of it. Oh my, you're carrying a lot of things. I'll just keep this until I have more room. Oh, that's why. That backpack is the source of the problem, I think. I think it's just too big. Yes, right. It's been tick. Hello. How are you? What are you reading? Yes, thank you. I hope you enjoy it. What do you do? I already asked that. Bye. Chronicle of Pagan. A little bit more refreshing than the knowledge. I remember my youth hearing tales of legendary times, unexplored places, fantastic beasts. I constantly pass my parents and instructors. Endless number of questions. How's this work? Why did they act in that manner? Where can I find these plants? My first of information was nay, still it's insatiable. I spent hours at the time investigating about my surroundings. Fortunately, as I reached early life, I lacked much in the way of physical prowess, making exploration difficult. Imagine my pleasure when I discovered that only life itself teach me things great and wondrous. Myriad of ancient tomes could offer nearly as much as then that I elected to dedicate this humble life to filling my mind library with all the knowledge I could. Thus, I humbly add these words to the collection of wisdom that already fills a multitude of bookshelves throughout this land. Hope I will someday immune curiosity into the hearts of others. 
Is that it? Okay, so you're not going to actually say anything about the book. Okay, so he said I had to go see Mithram. And I don't know where he is. Nope. Where is this? This is a castle. Nope. Maybe not. Thudden Ladux, thanks for the host. Captain's report. I recommend the new young guard Gromit for accommodation for bravery. As a troll, lads of the most march directly and purposely toward our station. We're prepared to destroy it from a safe distance with fire gems. But we attacked Gromit's sword that carried in his hands a little girl. We hesitated in our attack and he charged out and met the beast with his sword drawn. In the ensuing battle, the troll was driven to its knees and as it begged for its life, Gromit slew the creature. Some of Gromit's blows flew a little awry and the girl was mortally wounded by some of them. By one of them. She was the only peasant, however, and of no import, Grant will make fine additions to the officer's ranks. Fucking hell. It's a old trolley that tried to fucking do some good. What the fuck is that? It's like a stable. Where's the stable boy? Ooh. A kith. Are you going to attack me? Yep, I figured you were. Troll, Jesus Christ! Don't think I want to be there yet. What the hell did that mean? My intelligence just gone up one. I think it has. I think that was a stat increase noise. you might be a farmer. Greetings. Oh, I'm not intruding. No, you're welcome here, though you did alarm me a bit. We do not get many strangers up here, still it's not for simple folk to say where and when you travel. Do you know who I am? Well, to be honest, no. But someone in my stature certainly has no business telling a warrior what he can and cannot do. But I've not introduced myself. I'm uh, Corinth, I'm what you called. Called Slugnar. Well, I'm pleased to meet you, Slugnar. You are welcome here. So you don't see many strangers. We rarely have visitors here in the country. We do see that strange old hermit once in a while, though. Corinth? I know my mother, who did not survive my birth. Father wished to preserve her memory, but I named him after him. What hermit? 
believe his name is Mithran, that's who I'm looking for. Goes into Terrabrain now and then for supplies, I suppose. No one knows much about Mithran, but there are many tales about him. What kind of tales? Though no, I don't know them all. People claim he knows magic, some even claim to have brought magic scrolls from the old hermit. I not believe everything they hear. The Jews who live in the country away from most people, I do many things. Since my son did move away, I'm not as busy as I once was. My dear Cyrus, I'm so proud of him. His father and I are simple people, but Cyrus will do him great things. Look about you, my lord. Does this look like the home of a wealthy family? Ours are not easy lives, yet we are proud people. Not many can do what we do, and our family has lived in this valley and worked the land for generations. Uh, his father. That'll be my husband, Gwilym. Yes, Cyrus has gone to study with the Thurgists, who help many people as a Thurgist. Thurgists are, the dis are disciples of the Air Titan. Although Gwilym sacrifices to Lithos, I believe that Cyrus was born to be a Thurgist. Help people. Third is specialised in healing the sick, somewhere that they can even bring back the dead. What about Hydros? All the Titans are worthy of service. Gwilion did not much like the idea of Cyrus being a Thurgis, but saw the boy's dedication. Cyrus is meant to serve Stratos, then we must not stand in his way. All of his life, Cyrus has most enjoyed caring for others. He has always a talent for healing. It's not matter if it was a person or animal. Cyrus would heal if it was sick. I mean, he was born to be a Thurgis, not spend his life on a farm. All Titans are worthy. By that I mean all of the Titans have great powers. I do not mean that all are not worthy of good people's service and not claim that Pyrus and his sorcerers are worthy as such. Sorcerers? Ask me nothing of them. It's ill business to speak of the sorcerers. My, but you asked many questions. Yes, Cyrus loves animals. He's always been a caring man. Not at the farm. You don't want it very much for Cyrus to follow in his footsteps at the farm. I convinced Cyrus that his future was more important than his father's traditions. Sorry if I asked too many questions. I'm sorry if I made you uncomfortable. I enjoy your company. As I said, do not have many visitors. I'm glad to have someone to talk to. It's future. I knew that Cyrus became a farmer. He would be poor for the rest of his life. Gwilym does not know that I convinced Cyrus to seek Thurgis, but I had to. Cyrus sake, now he can lead a life far richer than that of a farmer. All of Gwilym's kin have always been herdsmen. Gwilym takes great pride in working the land. Cyrus is now our only son. Gwilym expects Cyrus to carry out the family's traditions. Goodbye. Ooh. Save before you steal. Who knows what might happen? I don't pause the fucking game, does it? Mamaki one. Is this where that troll was? It's gone now. Hmm. Not serious as well. Oh, we know who you are then. Greetings, greetings friend, I'm Gwilym, how are you? I'm fine. Good welcome, it's rare that Corinth and I get visitors here in the valley. In the valley? Corinth is my wife, she's a fine lady too. Corinth works hard every day, never complains, and being a good mother to our son too. Oh yes, I've met your wife. Where's your son? Surprised that my wife did not tell your ear about our son. Corinth's proud of seriously, sometimes I think she should speak of nothing else. Make no mistake, we are a lot about folk here. We also own a hydros as her ladyship does command. Talk my ear off. I love Corinth. But if you give that woman a chance, she'll talk the legs off a kith when it comes to that boy. Surely she told you that Cyrus has become a third just. Law abiding folk. It's correct, sir. Her ladyship administration has no reason to worry about us. The ruler, Lady Mardier, you need not pretend that you do not know the lady. We have shared I've always lived well by her mandates. Tell the ladyship they're always well in this district. Tell Mardier what? 
Oh, that all is well here. She's no need to worry about her subjects in the valley breaking her laws. You're her subjects too, but of course, and happy to be so. Do you think I work for more, dear? If else would a man so equipped and well armoured do but protect our ruler? Do not think that this is the reason why I've taken the time to talk to you. I welcome the company of others. I don't work for more, dear. Well, that's your business. Not for me to pry into your life. Uh, currently, <laughs> Great surprise to see my wife. Very proud of the fact that our son has become a thirdist. The healers who serve Strauss time of air. Farewell, farewell. So, you're just farming away over that big fucking troll walking about, are you? Yeah, it's just a random spawn, then, isn't it? Let's have a look in this cave. Oh, good. Jumping puzzle. This is going to blow up, isn't it? Sight. Restore to sight. Scroll of invisibility. Scroll of restoration. Okay, so the issue with the bag was carrying too much shizzle. What the hell was that? Jumping. Oh, hang on. Do I have to climb? No? No? Kind of look like a climby. Sort of situation. Now I know I can climb. Yeah, there we go. Eesh. Oh, fuck me, look at that. Okay. Brain, yeah, I'll be fine. Oh, 
Well, sounds like you're taking damage when you do that. Music sounds terrible. I thought Lithos was like took the dead or something. So why are they just strewn everywhere? I don't get it. Is it the souls he takes? Rather than the bodies. Save it here. Don't know where we are. Uh, bridge. 